The Rec Cove Generating Station is a 212 megawatt hydroelectric facility situated just south of the Cape Breton Highlands National Park. The facility is Nova Scotia's largest hydroelectric plant, producing on average 300 gigawatt hours every year. That's enough clean, renewable energy to power about 30,000 homes across the province. Here in Nova Scotia, about 7% of our electricity comes from hydropower, and almost half of that is generated by Rec Cove. Let's take a look at how hydro systems work. Our hydro stations allow us to harness the power of moving water to produce electricity. The water is collected in a reservoir and flows through a powerhouse. This kinetic energy turns a turbine. A generator converts the turbine's mechanical energy into electricity. The Rec Cove hydro system consists of seven reservoirs that collect water from 216 square kilometers of the Cape Breton Highlands Plateau. To take a closer look at the system, we'll start with the McMillan Reservoir. This reservoir has the tallest dam in Nova Scotia. It has a storage capacity of 35 gigawatt hours. Water from McMillan Reservoir flows through a 4.9 kilometer tunnel to the Gisborne Reservoir. The Shetta Camp Reservoir is the highest elevation in the system and is at the headwaters of the Shetta Camp River. Shetta Camp Reservoir has a storage capacity of 15.4 gigawatt hours. Water from the Shetta Camp Inganish 1 and Inganish 2 reservoirs feed into the Gisborne Reservoir through a series of canals. The Gisborne Reservoir is the largest reservoir in the system, with a storage capacity of 39.4 gigawatt hours. Water moving from Gisborne Reservoir to Red Cove Reservoir runs through the Gisborne Powerhouse. This is a small generating station with a 3.5 megawatt hydro turbine unit. Finally, the water flows to the Rec Cove Reservoir, located 366 meters above sea level. Rec Cove Reservoir has a storage capacity of 17 gigawatt hours and feeds into Surge Lake, an artificially created head pond through a 3.6 kilometer long tunnel. This head pond provides water storage ensuring we can quickly generate electricity when we need it to meet customer demand. When electricity is needed, water flows from Surge Lake down into the main powerhouse located 363 meters underground. Once energy has been created, the water flows through a 1.7 kilometer long tunnel out to the ocean. Completing the process and continuing Rec Cove's 40 year tradition of powering Nova Scotian homes and businesses. Through upgrades and investments in new technology, including refurbishing two turbine units between 2022 and 2024, our Rec Cove Hydro Systems will continue to deliver reliable, renewable electricity. Hydropower is an important part of our history in Nova Scotia and will play a key role in our clean energy future.